Climate change is a pressing issue, and many in Taiwan are doing their best to recycle and cut down on waste. Ms. Xie, an office worker in Taipei, never leaves home without her water bottle, eating utensils, and a reusable bag for her lunch. Taiwan has felt the full effects of global warming in recent years. According to reports compiled by think tanks, 96 percent of the population has acknowledged the impacts of climate change. While the adverse effects pertain to the entire world, Pacific Island countries are at the most risk. 呃，太平洋岛国还有非洲一带的这些国家，它可能因为发展的比较缓慢，那它对抗气候变迁带来的这个冲击是呃比较呃没有去做好准备的。Greenpeace campaigner Zhang Lixin pointed out that many Pacific Islanders have lost their homes due to rising sea levels. Likewise, the threat is imminent for an island like Taiwan. Taiwan has seen rising temperatures in recent years. To this, the chairman of the Taiwan Institute for Sustainable Energy, Eugene Jian, pointed to two strategies proposed by the United Nations to combat climate change, mitigation and adaptation. In addition to the general public's efforts to reduce waste and carbon emissions, businesses are also pushing ESG frameworks. At the same time, the Taiwanese government is working toward its net zero emission goal by 2050. Liu Lijun, Yu Xinghan, Hua Zhengshen, Vivian Xiao, TVBS World Taiwan.